Hey guys, so I'm just gonna film my brow tutorial for you real quick. I'm gonna make this a super quick, straight into it tutorial because I've had a lot of questions on how I've been doing my brows because of my Instagram page and people are just asking me, how do you get them to be like that ombre gradient? And so as you can see, this is what my natural brows look like. Looks absolutely insane when you have a full face of makeup on. So I'm going to just get started. First, I'm using the Anastasia Dip Brow in Chocolate. And this is my Zoeva 317 Wing Liner Brush. You don't have to use a Zoeva. Um, you can just use any sort of angled brush. I like this one for my eyebrows. I dip it in and I get it all on there. And then I remove a lot of the product off onto the sides of my dip brow container because you will use too much. Too much dip brow means looking really weird. So you really don't wanna do that. So also get a mirror and get super close to your face. So we're gonna start in the middle on the bottom of your brow and sculpt out the shape that you want. But I do sort of smaller strokes and just get your brow the length that you want it. And I usually keep the sculpted parts towards the inner part of my, or the underneath part of my brow because it's okay to look really sculpted down there, but the more you sculpt the top, the more drawn on your brows are gonna look. I sort of fill in the tail a little bit. Okay, see what I'm doing here? So I fill in about half away of my brows. So the whole half and tail end of my brows can be really as perfect as you want them to be um, or as imperfect, whatever you like. I like mine to be a little more sculpted like this. I just, this is how I like my brows to be done. And then when you start getting towards the intersection here, I take like where I want the bottom part of my brow to be and I do a gentle line all the way to meet up with what I just did before. So there is a line there. See what I'm saying? Like how you can see that line? And it just sort of gives me a guide to where I know I don't wanna go below. And then on the top of my brows, I gently, and I'm talking with the lightest hand ever, make a straight line across. So it kind of gives me a guide. I gradient it from here to here. So instead of like flicking it this way, I flick it in like that because then that concentrates more product towards the other side where you've already sculpted it out and less towards the front of your brows so that you get that ombre gradient effect. See? I don't know how good this looks in camera, to be honest. And then um, take a spoolie. So uh, this is just one on this end of one of my uh, brow products that I've gotten. And I just sort of gently spoolie the brow out and look at any sparse areas that I want to sort of fill in and then just be gentle with them and fill them in. The harder handed you are, the more serious your brow is gonna look. So that's that guys, I hope you guys like the brow tutorial. Um, it was super straightforward. I only use that one product and you can use a brow wax if you want, but I don't even waste my time sometimes, but it kind of just pushes the hairs down so they all kind of go one direction. Um, but that's that guys. I hope you guys like this makeup tutorial or brow tutorial. If you have any other tutorial requests, leave them in the comments below. If you guys would like to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and now Tumblr, you can follow me. All the links will be below. And I thank you guys for watching and I will see you at my next video. Bye.